What's up guys and welcome to Wonder Boy The Dragon's Trap. This is a game that's brand new, sort of, releasing either today or tomorrow, depends on when this video goes up, but Wonder Boy was actually a game that released on an old Sega console like 20 years ago, and is finally being re-released in like full HD, beautiful reworked art, and apparently you can change it back to the old graphic style at any time, but my favorite thing is you don't just get to play as Wonder Boy, but you get to play as a Wonder Girl as well. We'll be chilling with Wonder Boy today, but I just think that's a really, really cool touch. And yeah, I've never played the original game. This looks like a lot of fun, so I figured I'd, you know, give at least one video checking out the game. So let's go ahead and get started with Wonder Boy. Oh, and there's even a cutscene. Before you is the monster land. Well, sort of behind him. Overcoming various hardships, you have at last entered the dragon's castle. Your target is the dreaded dragon's room. He looks like a transformer, that dragon did. But unbeknownst to you is the fact that the dragon has the power to cast curses on his enemies. Is that it? Oh, it is, whoa, look at this! It looks like, like a Disney kind of cartoon or movie. Oh, I love his an his running animations, really cool. I really, really like that. And then I have some other stuff here. I don't know how to play the game yet, but it looks like I can jump and attack, oh, excuse me, sir. Um, whoa, whoa, gotcha. And, bah! So can I attack up or down? Looks like I can't, so it's very like old school so far in the way it controls, because apparently it's like exactly the same as the old school game, it just looks better, which is pretty cool. For a game like, you know, like this game, like I said, is like 20 years old, and it reminds me of like other cool games being remastered this year, like Crash Bandicoot. Like sometimes it being exactly the same is what we want. What is down there? Is that just an endless pit of death, or is that? Oh no, it's it sent me back here. Wait, why? I guess that was the wrong way. Is it like. Oh, I guess it's like a labyrinth, huh? All right then, boom, gotcha. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, the, the fact that we can't like attack up or down, sir, sir, stop it. The fact that we can't attack up or down is sort of like, I think Zelda 2? I haven't played Zelda 2 either, but I'm pretty sure it's like similar to, you know, how this controls and everything. I love this running cycle. It's really cool, so yeah, this is the way we're supposed to go. I'm gonna go left. I guess that was the correct thing to do. Ah, oh, sir, sir, Mr. Skeleton Bones. That guy definitely doesn't have a good head on his shoulders. Oh, okay, so I think whenever it doesn't make like a, you know, like a sad or defeated sound, I think that means we did the right thing. So far, so good. It's weirdly like technological in here. I thought this was gonna be like, you know, like a sword and shield knight on a classic adventure kind of game, but this is looking more like Portal the farther we go in. Mecha Dragon? <laughs> Maybe he is a Transformer. Maybe not, this isn't Wonder Boy at all, and it's just some kind of like Transformer movie tie-in game. I'm not doing so well with this guy. Um, I, I can't hit him once. Sir, sir, please stop. Is this like one of those like Mega Man style boss fights where you're not supposed to win? And then you know the, the dinosaur is supposed to win, you're supposed to like get a cutscene of like some guy saving you, some blonde haired dude. Like, I will save you, Mega Man. You're not ready for this. I don't think that's how it's supposed to go, because I've gotten him down a little bit, but I just can't hit him. Like, this is weird to time. Maybe I should stop just running into it over and over again. Oh, there we go. It was about to give me some tips there. Oh, so jumping seems to help a lot. I'm about at half health, but so is he. This weird, the weird part is when he's like juggling me, basically. <laughs> you think this is Smash Bros? I don't think Wonder Boy's a Smash Bros just yet. Ooh, oh, darn it. Oh, almost got you. Boom, no. Maybe I can't hit him in my invincibility frames either, because it's sort of weird. Come on, oh, eight health, eight health, ready. Yeah, there we go, right in the noggin. That wasn't bad, and we got a couple coins for it. He <laughs> look, what? Uh-oh, whoa, what happened? Wh what? Ah, we're a dragon, <laughs> a mecha dragon, okay. We're a Yoshi, look at us, we're a little Yoshi guy. Oh, he is so cute, I love the animation, the walk cycles in this game. Gosh darn it, they're beautiful, ooh, fire. What is the, f the, oh, I just used it. It was like a little fireball that I just completely wasted. Okay, very cool. So can we, I, was that the, the remainder of Wonder Boy? Are we just now Wonder Dragon? Dragon tails, dragon tails. Ooh, okay, so we just used a key on the door. Not a surprising fact. Oh my gosh, I can't get over the art style in this game. I love how some of the skulls still have some eyeballs in them. Like that's really cool, ow, rude. Oh gosh, I'm about to die. I have only one heart, so I gotta be careful. I mean, I get hit there and I didn't take any damage, so maybe not? Or maybe since it's still the tutorial, it's just a little wonky. This is really cool, though. 
Like, I, I, so far, I mean, I'm still in the tutorial, so I shouldn't say too much, but I wouldn't mind playing more of this. All right, let's hop up there. Oh gosh, no, the Tetris blocks. They're beating me out here. All right, I'm just gonna wait right here. <laughs> I love that I can just curl up, take a little nap, huh? And he can still attack in this mode. Oh, I love it. That is just beautiful. And what? Oh, which way am I going? Oh no, the kingdom. It's being destroyed by evil people. I must stop them. See, these guys have some heads on their shoulders, but they don't have much shoulders, seeing how it's, you know, just bone. Oh, come on, get you. There you go. So, so far the game isn't like crazy tough. Like some of these old school games, especially like on like the Sega Nintendo consoles, like they were like gruelingly difficult. So we're running away from the burning down fortress or town or whatever. So this Yoshi guy, once human, now Yoshi, is watching his home burn down. And now proceed with your adventures under, or adventurous undertaking. Or maybe that was just a castle. Maybe that wasn't like a whole town. Wonder Boy, the dragon's trap. So now we gotta just deal with being a Yoshi. Oh, imagine if it just turned into like an Animal Crossing at this point, where it's like no more action. You just have to live with like other Yoshis. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Well, I can't go in any of these. This is like a nice town though, um, with little bouncy blocks. Uh, I can't go into anything right now, unless I'm not pressing the right button. Uh. Hello? Anybody home? It's just me, Yoshi guy. I can't go past here. What is with the, the, the weird checkered blocks? This is a full on adventure game so far though, I like it. Maybe I can go in this door? This door doesn't seem to have a lock. Or maybe I'm just, whoa! Oh, hey, look at that! I found out how to change back to the, the, the classic. Oh, that's pretty cool. And you can see how the art style translates. Oh, that is so awesome. You can just do that at any point in time too. You don't need to go into options menu or anything. All right, well, I like this a lot better. Oh, wait, could we go in here? Open. Oh, so we can go into this one. Maybe we could go in other ones. I was just not holding it long enough. Now let's go back. What's down here? Oh, fancy. Um, Where does this lead? Just back out here. Hold on, I'm getting really confused. I think I might have to go back and check to make sure I'm not. No, I can go in these doors as well. I just wasn't holding it long enough. I'm just expecting it to be one button press. So let's go first in the very first building because I'm sure there's like important key events. Wow, with a face like yours, I'd be looking for an answer to it right now. Buddy, you're a pig. Um, I was, <laughs> I guess that's our hint not to be there. Hold on, yikes, rude much. What's in here, the well. So I hope we can swim as this guy. I mean, it looks like we can at least jump around. Can I get up here? Whoa, no. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can swim unless I'm not pressing the right button, but it's not really telling me any like buttons to press and I'm pressing most of them. I wasted all my fireballs again. The beach, classic location. No fancy name or anything. So where does this door lead? Oh, it's really weird that they just have doors from nowhere because it sort of like makes me lose my direction on where I'm supposed to be going, because now I'm really curious. Is that is that the game's way of saying I shouldn't be going that way just yet? Hmm. Well, there is, oh, you know what? This is a healing place. Maybe this is where I can find an antidote. You look funny. Your first shot is on me. Well, gee, thanks. Yeah, cure, cure. Buy. Why, why can't I buy it? It says it's free. Um, am I full? Why can't I buy it? It says it's free. Can I not afford free? I don't understand. Whoa, it looks totally different in old school version. Then what am I doing wrong? Huh. Well, if I can't buy the antidote, I might as well buy cool stuff. I can buy a mithril sword. Okay, maybe not the best. Oh boy, only after I buy it, huh? Um. Well, I can't use it because I am a dragon. Apparently dragons cannot wield swords because this game appreciates equal opportunity. Equipment is useful for increasing your attack points. Okay, so now he's just telling me different stuff. I don't know if there's something happening that's not supposed to be, because it's just, it's not letting me buy that. Maybe now that I bought something else, maybe it's like one of those things like, you can't use the bathroom unless you buy something, buddy. I still can't buy it. Well, I'm going back down here, you know? Oh, hey, look at that, I got more health. Okay, <laughs> I'll take it. Wasn't expecting to find that down here. But one more thing I have found, except for the antidote. I still don't get that. Wait, that's, I just went in a circle, whoops. 
Okay, so I'm just going on the beach, you know? If I have to be a Yoshi for the rest of my life, I might as well go and find Yoshi's Island. You know what I'm saying? There we go. Oh gosh, crabs. Creepy crabs. Ma, Get out of here, creepy crab. I don't want to deal with you. These snakes are everywhere, though. I mean, I hope they're not poisonous. No! Oh. There's stuff down here. Okay. No taken. What else is down here, then? More creepy crabs, which I'm not a fan of. Is this gonna be like a complete Metroidvania in the way that there's this next to no linearity? I can go ahead and just sort of do what I want if I have the right equipment to fit the situation? Yeah, that sounds pretty cool, but also pretty confusing. Ouch, that hurt. I'm thinking of like, if I can't find what's at the end of this area and like maybe it progressed the story, I might try restarting and seeing if I can't get that antidote to work, because if it's free, and I don't have anything in my inventory, I have no clue what is stopping me. All right, so I'm just trying to carefully platform on this beach with floating little platforms. I don't understand what kind of beach has something like this, but hey, I'm not gonna complain. Well, I wasn't until I fell back into the water. <laughs> Get out of here, Squidward. Oh gosh, we got green Squidward. Oh, ow, my face. So I got like more than one ability right now. I got a tornado. Okay, what's the tornado didn't do exactly what I thought it would do. It's like a Koopa shell. All right, well, um, that guy does not look fun. Ooh, give me that coin, thank you. That guy gave me four coins, so some of these guys aren't just giving me one coin. That's pretty cool. That guy gave me four as well, so I can go ahead and buy more armor in a moment. I don't know if the dragon dude can equip them, but I've made my way to the end of the ocean. That is, ow. Oh no, oh, so I just used like an elixir because I ran out of health. Green crab, I don't wanna deal with no green crab. Oh, hold on. Getcha, 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 gotcha. Don't know what the arrows do either. Let's try one. Nope, wrong button. It's so cool I can do that. Whoa, oh, it, it shoots up. Weird, okay. Let's get rid of you. And I really don't know too much about where I'm going or what I'm doing, but I might as well do it, because why not? I love the pirate ship in the background. That's really cool. This game's super chill. Like, it's tough, but it's like really chill. I like that a lot. Ooh, gotcha. Whoa, sir. Sir, hold on, yep, no, nope, wrong button. Right, I pressed the right button that time, but I missed both times. Oh gosh, it's like a Lakitu, but it's worse, because he just he won't go away. Please leave me alone. Ooh, what is this? Maybe this guy will also give me an antidote? Or not? Which door, I don't know which door to go into. Uh, oh, hey, look at this, cross dressed like a goblin, no questions asked. Okay. Uh, I can't afford a Master Shield. Are we going Zelda right now? <laughs> Hyrulean Shields up in here? Ooh, and here's a chest. We get a key, which I can actually use back at the other area, which will be great. So I can't do anything like this, so I might as, oh, that's it. This is a dead end after this. You know what game this is reminding me of? It's reminding me of a game I used to play on the PlayStation called Toomba. No, I died. Wonder Boy, no. Game over, no. Oh, whoa, what is this? Hold on, there's like a little mini game. Ooh, ah, no, wait. Oh, I don't think I hit the jackpot. But I'm back at the village. I still have my two hearts, so do I have that key still? Hey, let's go and try to open this bad boy up. I do. So maybe getting a game over wasn't that bad because I just got a quick teleport back to the village. What's up here then? Is this another defense store? There's just a shield on the top of this and a bunch of meat. Good old grub. Um, Where are we? I don't know, we're on the top of the windmill. Whoa, we've already found the desert. I love how there's just like no names for these places, you know, it's just the desert. Well, I think this would definitely see, feel like a world two, so I'm not ready to go to world two. Instead, I'm gonna fly all the way back down here. And maybe now that I've just done other random things, you're like, all right, have your antidote. Maybe, nope, still no antidote. Like, am I pressing the wrong button? I'm just, now I'm just turning on, you know, music and stuff. I am so confused. I don't know. Well, I still can't buy the antidote. So I don't know if there's something I need to do or if it's something wonky, I'm not really sure. But so far, I've enjoyed Wonder Boy a lot. I think that's we're gonna finish it off for today. So that was our look at Wonder Boy Remastered. A really cool game, I like it. So maybe we'll play more, it depends. If you guys really, really wanna see more, maybe I'll try to figure out what's going on with the antidote thing, and then we'll move forward. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video on Wonder Boy. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment Wonder Zebra, so now you've watched in the video, 
Everyone, you are a Zebratastic viewer. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.